<laughs> All right, Crunchyroll. So we've just realized it's been what two, three months. You yeah. still haven't sponsored us. We're gonna make this really easy for you guys. We have Adrian's email down here. He'll send you his address, and we got his phone number all on the screen or yeah. in the description. Whatever, whatever you guys need. Sponsor us already. Do it for Lily. Look at the pug. Listen to her, please. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get started with the news. All right, let's... Tracer from Overwatch is coming in an Android version. Woo! It's about goddamn time. Yeah, like, you know, this thing is gonna sell. It is available for pre-order at the official Blizzard website. I pre-ordered three uh, of them. They are probably gonna run out, so I suggest you get them fast. Faster I pre-ordered six now. Fast and furious fast. Now Just I have to get them. So on Tuesday, Funimation announced that they have the license to the first season of Sally Deadly Sins, which was supposed to be Netflix, but I guess they just don't have the balls to release their own Netflix. Netflix, you dumb goof! You could have released this! I thought this was a Netflix original! Yeah! So we don't have a release date or anything, but we know that it is coming from Funimation, so you can be assured that your wallet will be safe. Thank God fucking Aniplex didn't pick it up, because you, yeah, you know that shit. Because I'm broke because of them! Hashtag Give me a sponsor us. And finally, we also have uh, February 17th is when the second season of Silent Deadly Sins comes out on Netflix. Woo! So you guys can look forward to that. That's actually this Saturday, I think. All right, Hajimete no Gao, the anime that's coming out soon, and big boobs, and big booty, and she looks like a typical like girl slutty girl. Oh, anyway, talking about her. Her, the anime key visual, her, 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 the key visual for the anime is out on their official website, Woo! and it looks pretty not much. It just reveals her, like covering her face, and you just see her body, which is all you need to see. I hope this anime is good because it's popping out everywhere now. Like all right, so Strawman King, I have no idea what the fuck that is because I didn't see that during my time. You know what I mean? That's an old anime. Adrian knows more about it, but all I know is that it's Shaman King, and I lied, I do know a little bit about it. He's a guy that has a shaman song. Yeah. Basically, the point is that they were gonna have a reboot, which actually sounds pretty cool. I, I am for having reboots of really old shows, because like with today's technology and shit, they look fucking amazing. But the creator, but the creator Hiroki Takei said, "Nah, dog. You know why? Because we don't have the original anime or voice cast. So if they're not in the in the in the fucking club, we ain't doing this shit." Oh, that's uh, really his excuse. That was his excuse, which is nice. It's it's sweet or whatever. I mean, it makes. It's just him looking out for his his friends. Yeah, it's people. Did they die or what? I, I have no idea. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, maybe they don't even want to do it. Maybe they're like so big now. They're like, Shaman King? Fuck that shit. I'm making that sale. I'm, I'm, on, I'm Kurito now. I don't know. It's, but whatever. Uh, they, he says that he, he hopes there's another chance to remake it sometime down the line. And I'm down for that. You know, as long as it's cool, I'm down for that. You know, I've never seen it. But I heard it was pretty. Cool. I heard it was pretty dope, so I'm down for a second season of Shaman King. Alright, Go Sick, the anime that actually came out around 2011, yeah. and is actually now considered a classic anime. Nah, get the fuck you know, out of that, really? that, That's how long it took for them to release it here to the United States, and it came out of nowhere. Funimation announced that they will release the first half of Go Sick. It's about goddamn time, oh, cool, man. What about the second half? Then? The second half hasn't been announced. Right. The first half will come out on May 30th, which is not that far away. No, it's like one, two months ago? Yeah. One, two months from now? Yeah. So that's pretty cool. Dope. Even better than that is that they're having an English dub, which yes. is brand fucking new. We have never heard of English dub. Yeah, but we didn't even know this thing was getting dubbed, like, honestly. It just kind of Two years ago, I was like, hey man, you remember Gosa? Where the fuck is that? How come yeah. you don't have an English dub for that shit? Yeah. Here it is now. According to like sources, Bandai actually oh, got the license for it uh, for the US. But right. you know they went to shit here <laughs> and they never released it. So I'm pretty sure Funimation is like, yo, I will release it. Ever since Gurren Logan, it hasn't been the same. Nope. <laughs> Anyways. But uh, yeah, now it's actually considered a classic. Like it came out a long time ago. Ghostic is a good series too, actually. Yes. It's a really fun series. That's I, totally I, too. Good series. I like it a lot. I will probably pick it up because it's a series that was super cool. Yeah, so. think, think of it like this. Um, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood yeah. ended. Uh -huh. No Six came out. Ooh, Bones! It was Bones! Yeah, it was Bones. And then No Six came out. No Six was pretty dope. No Six, Go Six, get it? No. Hey. Then all these other animes came out and they just completely forgot about Go Six. Yeah. I, I never thought it would come to the States, you know? No, no. Like, that just, it was a surprise. Like, Funimation was like, you guys want to see a magic trick? Oh, Alright, guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you again next time. Like, comment, subscribe. Ja. Bye.